So you might be trying to figure out how you can auto swipe on your iPad. Now, this is a pretty basic process for the most part. So what you wanna do, what you wanna first get started with, is you wanna make your way over to your settings application and you wanna go into accessibility. So go inside of the accessibility options and then you wanna go and click into switch control. So there should be a little option right over here somewhere that says something like switch control. So you can find it wherever it is, which is right here. And then number one, all you wanna do is go and click on switches, which is right over here. So tap on the switches and we wanna create and basically add a full screen switch. So click on add new switch. You wanna go and do, we can do screen, which is right here. And you want to go and make sure this full screen option is enabled. So I've already enabled it. So you wanna tap into there. And as long as it says full screen right there, then you're pretty much good to go. Now what we wanna do here is we wanna go back and we wanna click on add recipe. So right here where it says recipes, we wanna go ahead and click on to add recipes. And here we wanna create a new recipe. So tap on create a new recipe. And then what we wanna do is we want to go and create the name of it to whatever we want to. So in this case, we'll just go and create the name swipe for this one, right? Now what we wanna do here is we wanna go and click on switches, which is right here. And we want to assign a switch to this. So now what we can do is we can go and when we get into this full screen option, we want to go and click on custom gesture. So all we want to do is tap on custom gesture, and this is where you can create the gesture that you want. So in this case, what you can do is you can go and create, you know, swipes. So you can swipe up, you can basically then swipe down, you can swipe to the side, you can swipe to this side, you can create these swipes whichever way you want to, and it's a pretty basic process as at this point, but you can create whatever type of swipe, whatever you swipe here is how it's going to you know, demonstrate when you actually do it. So now what we can do is when you're ready, you can go and click save. And now what we can do is we want to click back, right? So we want to click back one more time. And what we want to do is we want to click back one more time to our main page. And right here where it says launch recipe, we want to assign this to the recipe we just made, which was swipe. So what we want to do is we want to tap out of all these things and we want to tap on swipe, which is right there. So then what we want to do is we want to click back out and we're almost good to go. So now what we want to do is we want to click back one more time and we want to basically get back into our accessibility panel. And now what we want to do is we want to scroll all the way down. And now what we want to do is we want to go into accessibility shortcut, which is right here. And what you want to make sure that you have done is you want to make sure this is enabled. And you want to make sure switch control is enabled as well. So all you want to do is when you triple click the power button, that the switch control will basically come up. So now we're pretty much ready to go. So now what we can do is we can make our way over into an application or wherever we want to. And now you can see that if I were to go ahead and basically like get back into my like pencil icons, wherever my pencil icon is. So you can see whenever I write, I'll do something right. So if I want to, I can go ahead and basically just highlight whatever I want to. I can go into the application I want to swipe. You want to triple click the power button. So find the power button, triple click it, right? And what will happen is you'll get into this you know, option that will come up. And what I would recommend for you to do is to type in switch control. And it'll go ahead and actually go do that switch that we did. So when you tap onto the display, it will go ahead and actually automatically swipe exactly how we did it earlier. So it's really, really cool. That's basically the process. Now, if you want to get out of here, all you have to do is triple click the power button one more time, and then it will go and get you out of the auto swipe. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.